So we've got a great manufacturer here who makes weapons, weapons accessories, uh, Daniel Defense, and this is Joe. Joe, how you doing? Good to see you, Todd. Thank you for having me. Yeah, thanks for coming. So they got some really, really cool stuff. Uh, we're going to, I guess, start off with what you got for SHOT Show this year. Sure. Uh, something we're all really excited about is the new uh, Daniel Defense ISR. It's a integrally suppressed 300 blackout. Uh, the overall barrel length is 16 inches. The, so uh, that's legal? It is, it is consumer. It is legal, yes. Um, you need a tax stamp for the you can. Need, you need a tax stamp for the can and only the, only the can, so only one NFA tax stamp. Uh, it's chambered in 300 AAC blackout, has a pistol length gas system. Uh, the barrel and most of the suppressor is shrouded by the modular float rail 12.0. What you guys become famous for. It's really uh, Right, right, yeah, yes. Very nice. Very uh, minimalistic design. It is. Uh, MSRP on this is set at $31.99 and we'll be ready to deliver in April. So you guys are manufacturing right now. I mean, they're on the line. They're on the line. Getting ready to come out. Now that kind of brings us, I read on Soldier Systems that you guys actually, you just told me you lowered your MSRP from last year. That is correct. And that you are keeping up with the demand. Y'all have been opened up capacity, but you are sold out for 2013. That, that, that is correct. We're building and shipping guns every day. The majority of our production capacity has already been sold, but every day we're shipping anywhere from 100 to 160 guns a, a day. That's insane. Well, I know you've got a great product, and you know every product's been short on the shelves lately at the gun shops, but at least you guys haven't jacked your prices up. Cool. So what else we got? We got the Mark 18. Yeah, sure. This one's been around for a while. This is the uh, Mark 18. Uh, SBR. In SBR and Flat Dark Earth. Uh, this is chambered in 556. Uh, very popular uh, amongst law enforcement community. Uh, a lot of federal agencies are carrying this rifle. Uh, building a lot more of these uh, this year than we did last year. Uh, we identified that there was a much more much more of a demand for this product, so there's going to be a lot more of these available. So, and you need an attack stand for this as well? That's for correct. The consumer? That's correct. And then that's a 10 and a half inch barrel? It's a 10.3 inch barrel. 10 .3. Uh, okay. yeah, very, very close to the configuration uh, carried by U.S. Special Operations Command. And um, you can buy the upper receiver group separate yes. from Yes, the... we, we, we sell the complete rifle and the upper receiver group. And then you have the uh, four grip? Yes, uh, this is the convert grip. This item does have an NSN. Uh, we've delivered probably in the neighborhood of 16,000 of these to U.S. Special Operations Command. Uh, when used as a full-length grip, it does have a flat for a pressure pad right. for, for an illumination device. But it's adjustable. Uh, but it is adjustable. You can you can position that outer sleeve anywhere you want it. Uh, 16, the, is it 16? Yeah, 16 different positions around the circumference, so it's completely adjustable for each shooter's uh, ergonomics. You're not restricted of having the pressure pad just on the left or right side of the firearm. And if you don't need it or just don't like a full-length grip, you can unscrew that cap on the bottom, pull that sleeve off. And that becomes this. And that becomes that just nice uh, short grip. Yeah. We are making our own line of uh, flash hiders and muzzle brakes. Those, yep. those are available. Uh, cold hammer forged barrels, rail systems, all that stuff is still in full production. It's all made in the USA? All made in the USA. Okay. All right. Well, great. Well, thanks, Jeff. Appreciate you Thank coming. Thank you. Appreciate it. Take care.